So, good afternoon. This is James Terrell, your art teacher from Friendship Woodridge. Hope all you guys are doing well. It's been a while since I've seen you. But I hope that you are out there still creating. Uh, here we have a mural that I have done at the Bus Boys and Poets downtown on 14th and V Street. It stretches around the building. If you notice, all the work seems to flow together with the use of various lines, curved lines straight lines, zigzag lines, also the use of perpendicular lines, lines that are parallel, we have lines that are crisscross, we have lines that are straight, lines that are curved, lines that are jagged. Also, if you notice, I am also focusing on the African mask as a motif for this particular mural. The African masks are used in Africa, of course, but they are geometrical shapes that make up the faces. They are simplified faces. So for this project, what I want you to do is try to imagine that you've been given an assignment to do a mural. What would your mural say? What would your lesson be that you're trying to teach other people as they walk through to see your work. What is your message? Uh, my mural here is a message of hope. If you notice, I've incorporated words in my particular artwork. Have hope. Here it says, love through hearts, XOXO. Here we have the I in love, meaning that I love. Here we have another one that says the word love in it, a peace sign. So I'm also incorporating peace signs and hearts and different symbols that we use in, as human beings to communicate to other people. So, moving on, as we go across to the other side of the mural, and this is a Bus Boys and Poets sign, they commissioned me to do this particular piece. They paid me uh, money to do this design across the building. Here we have another particular design called the Hazma. It's a symbol from Arabic culture, which means peace and hope and love and strength. As we move on down to the other side of the building, Other symbols of the heart, love. We have shapes, triangles. We have zigzag lines, curved lines. Here we have the word hope, H O P E, right above the head of the African mask is looking up with the heart on his chest. Notice the zigzag pattern underneath the neck, and notice the accident line around the ears, around the neck, around the sides of the head. Here we have another part of the mural. Also it says, have hope. It's a guy holding his heart, or giving his heart out to the people during his time of great stress and sadness. He is still giving out love and hope. Notice on the side of it, the heart, the straight lines, zigzag lines, the circles, accident with curved lines. Here we have on the next to it, another example of hope. We have four people together, standing in unity, standing in love, standing in hope. It's trying to give people hope out here for during this time of this coronavirus. Above the head are the XOXO, which symbolizes love. Next to it, we have a The symbol I came up with is derived from the DC flag. The DC flag has three stars and then two arms. But here I've changed the stars into hearts, showing that we can get through this particular time with love. Again, here we have another example of a mask, zigzag lines across the head. 
So in your spare time, today your assignment is to try to simplify African mass. You can uh, use words, you can use different types of lines to create this particular mass and different kinds of patterns on your particular subject. Here, I got a little bit more colorful where it says, sing a song of hope, stay calm. There's a guy playing music. His music also is soothing, helps people get through stress sometimes. And he's playing the guitar, one of my favorite instruments. Also, next to him, we have the EXO, EXO, we have the hearts as well. Thank you. Mm -hmm. DC .com. Oh, please do. Thank you. I'll see you again this week for your next assignment.